everybody, Linda aka The Gamer Girl here, and normally I don't talk about G Fuel on my channel, but when they get a limited edition kind of G Fuel, I gotta try it out. So, this is normally energy focus box, which is weird to me. I, I thought it was gonna be in a licensed box, but I guess not. So, first off, weird to me. But what this is is it is Crash Bandicoot, Crash 4, G Fuel, Wampa Fruit. It is Extreme Focus, Zero Sugar, Performance Energy. Now we're going to see what it is the flavor wise. Let's see if it tells us on here. It is... Do -do 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 -do. Citrus. Green coffee bean extract, blueberry, cherry. So pretty much it's going to be a bunch of like citrusy flavors put into one. So I like the logo first off. I like that they actually, you know, partnered with the team over at Activision and made an official Crash Bandicoot drink. So you can hear... sound effects <laughs> okay so it's limited edition it's the official drink of esports let's see if it's worth your time i'm gonna try it so you don't have to if you don't like it <sighs> not what i expected i'm getting a hint of like grape is there grape in here That's the blueberry. I'm tasting the blueberry, okay. I'm getting more blueberry than I am getting cherry. Okay. I was shocked. When I see cherry, usually I get drowned in cherry whenever I drink anything that's got cherry in it. Let's see. sure if I like this one <laughs> because I expect well I understand it's an energy drink I expect like a little pop to it when you get citrusy flavors wampa fruit I was expecting more cherry and everything like that I feel like I'm drinking grape soda to be honest <laughs> that's what I'm feeling like I feel like I'm drinking grape soda or or uh what's that blue soda that uh Mountain Dew I feel like I'm drinking Mountain Dew Now, I've had G Fuel before, and those flavors popped. But I wonder if it's because there was a lot more added than the normal scoop. Because when you have G Fuel, you can put as much or as little as you want. I usually get more G Fuel when I put it in there for the, you know, the, the shaker that we have when we got. I got a shaker from TwitchCon. I'm not, I wasn't expecting, I've never gotten their cans either. So that might be why. For me, I'm a little disappointed. So it was it's not a horrible flavor. If you like blueberry, if you like grape, you're gonna love it because it tastes like blueberry overload. Like I I don't know why they even put like cherry anything in here. Yeah, it says it says tart cherry. Blueberry. What? Broccoli and kale are in, <laughs> oh my gosh, I never have read ever an energy drink. Carbonated water, so be sodium, glu gluten, natural and artificial flavors, vitamin and amino acid, well of course caffeine, citric acid, vitamin B12, vitamin B6, some bunch of words that I can't say. Potassium, citrate. Well, there's a bunch of potassium in there, so I'll get my potassium that I can't get anymore. <laughs> okay, I never saw broccoli in my energy drink. I feel like I'm being pumped right now. Kale, kale and broccoli. 
are ingredients in this soda slash energy drink. I would never have thought to say that, ever. Maybe that's why it's throwing me for a loop. <laughs> Okay, since I am reviewing this beautiful energy drink, I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10 for the simple fact that when I see wampa fruit, I expect maybe a mango flavor, maybe, you know, something because wampa fruits, they look like mangoes. So why does it taste more like blueberry? beyond me. Maybe that packaging is telling me more than, than the pictures. <laughs> Maybe it's actually, it's a rebranding of another energy drink and they just slapped a Crash Bandicoot on it. I don't know. And Elvis is sighing too. <laughs> I didn't plan that. That is perfect. So yeah, it's, it's definitely worth trying. Um, they do have it in a can form and they do have it in the normal packaging that they have where you can put as much or as little as you want. I keep the can just for presentation wise uh, because I have Crash Bandicoot 1, 2, and 3 remastered poster from GameStop when they were still giving out the posters. But other than that, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna buy this flavor again. I will though probably try another flavor if, if I'm being honest, I like G Fuel. I was, I'm, Surprised that I didn't like this one as much. I, I've had plenty of G Fuel flavors in the past after, you know, getting the shaker and everything like that. It was a good ploy. They, they got me. But this one was a miss for me a little bit. Maybe because I was expecting something different. Maybe if I didn't expect anything and didn't think it was going to be Wampa Fruit, maybe it would have been a different flavor for me. Who knows? But what are your thoughts, guys? Would you drink it if it's a uh, blueberry with broccoli and kale? <laughs> Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. If you made it all the way to the end, hashtag blueberry, hashtag broccoli, hashtag kale. And you know what? Hashtag energy drink surprise. <laughs> you know, and throw in any hashtag you want. How about that? If you think of something funny for why there's broccoli and kale in this energy drink, Drop it in the comments. I want to see something hilarious. And if you're hilarious enough, you will get pinned. I will pin your comment in there. And you will have a good time. But yeah, um, these are roughly about $11 for a pack of four. About $36 for a pack of 24 I think it is. Or you can buy the normal pack that looks like a Kool-Aid dispenser, basically. And it is about $37. So... That's without shipping and handling and everything like that. Definitely try it out for yourself. Let me know. If you do try out the G Fuel, tag me. Let me know that you made it. And, and I want to get your take on it. So have a good one. Keep on gaming, everybody. If you're new, hit the sub button. Helps out the channel. Salute. Peace. Linda the Gamer Girl. She's here, she's playing games. Linda the Gamer Girl She's here, she's playing games too